this is a massive collar. Welcome to the Rowdy.com B3. I'm Bug Fever. I'm Bass Masters, eh? He's the Canadian Canuck hockey man. Look, I, I love Canada. My sister is Canadian, officially. So they sent me She didn't start out that way. No, she didn't start out that way, but you know. She's a foreigner now. Yeah. Or is she well, both? I think she might she be both. She forsook her native I soil. I cannot believe it. All uh, right. You know. Speaking of what are you going to do? Speaking of forsaking, NASCAR burning issues, what are they, Buzz Cutler? What does that have to do with forsaking? I don't know. What are the questions? Well, Paul. You can't just do a segue by saying, you know, if you guys. Hey, look, there's, yes. there's a piece of gum. And speaking of gum, yes, you what can. time is it? I mean, that's not a real segue. That's a segue. No, no, it's not. It's not a segue. It's a random collection of thoughts. And Gee, we're gonna I can't believe it. All came right. From okay, Fever. everybody stop talking except for me now. Um, Paul Bernard <laughs> is going to be driving the Nationwide Series full time. Yeah. Do you think this will help him improve his performance in the Cup Series? Wow. You know, I, I barely. Think first, barely. First of all, I think it's a good thing. Yeah. But he's got a ton of starts in I Cup. I know. I know. And he really has a lot of starts in Cup. I don't know if he's ever had great equipment. But he's never exactly been the strongest performer on his own team either. So <laughs> you think? I, I'm not really. I'm not trying to slam Paul Menard. I'm just saying it's hard to sit here and say getting a full nationwide series under your belt is going to improve given the experience he already I mean, has. Here's the question. Do you believe that seat time in the nationwide car does anything to help you in the you, cup car? For certain guys, absolutely you know, yes. If, if it, you're moving up through the right. ranks, it absolutely does help I don't you. think it's much. I mean, For Danica Patrick, yeah. for example? Yes. I mean, yeah. duh, of course it's going to But, but it's not going to hurt Paul Menard, but I don't think it's magically going to save the day and he's going to turn around and get into the chase of the championship because he raced But nationwide. maybe, maybe nah. there is this. If he gets in good Roush, Yates, Roush, Fenway equipment, whatever the heck, in the Smith Nationwide equipment. Series, and he runs up front, maybe that confidence actually builder? helps him confidence-wise, running with guys up front and how you do that. That's just a little bit different up maybe. front than it is in the, in the pack. So Maybe Cutler will stop running him down, and he'll get better at confidence. That would be nice. Next issue. Um, I got a list of drivers who have made the playoffs previously during right. the Chase era, but wow. not last year. I want you to tell me which of these guys is most likely to be right now. back in the chase? Can we pick one? I'll in pick 2010. one right now. Can I give the names first? Matt Kenseth. Can I give you the names first? Oh, okay, go ahead. First? Go ahead. Jesus. Got to be Matt Kenseth. Clint Boyer, mm -hmm. Jeff Burton, Kyle Busch, Dale Earnhardt Jr., Kevin Harvick, Matt Kenseth, Elliot Sadler, and Martin Truex Jr. Okay, Martin's with a new team. I know... Um, Kyle Busch. My, first of all, Kyle Busch, Kyle Matt Bush. Kenseth are the two guys yeah. that I would jump on first. Big time. And, I, you know, I've gone on record as saying, and I'll say it again, that I think Dale Earnhardt Jr. can do it as well. Maybe Jeff Burton, too. I, uh, if those are know, Clint Boyer. Why don't you guys just pick the whole list? Okay, fine. Kyle Busch. I mean... Kyle Busch is going to get into the chase. It, it's going to be weird I, I to be Personally, I think w what we've seen from Matt Kenseth means that last year was an anomaly. So I think Matt Kenseth's a guy I would... Even over Kyle Busch, and I know that seems crazy That's because I think the Gibbs stuff is great, and Kyle's learned a lot, and he's an incredible talent. But if you're looking for the consistency that it takes to get in the chase, who have we seen that from throughout his career? The 17 car, and they finished up last year a lot better than they ran in the middle of the season. So I'm going to go with Kenseth on this one. I'm going with Kyle Busch. It's an anomaly that he hasn't made it. He's going to get in there. It is an anomaly, it. too, but he's it's a real gonna... anomaly that Matt hasn't made it. Yes. Next issue. Next issue. All right. Casey Mears from... Earnhardt Ganassi, I guess it wasn't Earnhardt Ganassi at the time, to Hendrick, to Richard Childress Racing. To he's, the unemployment he's line. He's washed out at all three. Does he deserve a fourth chance? You know, everybody has a dream, Cutler, and, and why you got to try to, I mean, the way you yeah, phrase it. That's kind of how I feel about it. I don't want to dump on Casey I'm Mears. I'm not dumping on Casey I mean, Mears. He's won a cup race, which a lot of guys haven't right. done. Granted, he didn't do as much at Hendrick as you would have hoped. Looking back at his ten tenure at Childress, You'd have to say last year was a down year for those guys yep. for most yep. of the season. So, Casey Mears, there are reasons. You can find reasons why he hasn't ever really run up front consistently. He, I say give him one more shot. One more shot for Does Casey Mears. Does that mean that he has the ability to do that? Of yeah. course it doesn't mean that. He might just not have the ability, and that might be the ultimate reason. It's just he just can't quite do that. Buck, not been, everyone can. You've been hanging out with Bass far too long. You're becoming the world's second most But I'm not going to deny that if I have well, to. 
I, I lost my job before and it sucks. It, it hurts. I don't want to see Mir. Give him another chance. Give him a shot. Give him a shot. Give him a shot. He's a nice guy. Shut in your arm. Yeah. Yeah. He, yeah. Well, he yeah. wasn't very nice to Jeff Gluck. He wasn't well, that nice Jeff to me Gluck either. Once. He sucked. Casey yeah, Mears. Jeff Gluck went out and took him on. And see, we're doing the whole anti-Gluck thing. We're just for everybody. Casey so, Mears was cool. He was nice to me in the Phoenix airport. He was kind of so. mean to me once. Yeah, that's right. When we interviewed him at Pocono, yeah. you, you kind of rubbed him I was like, off. hey, you're wearing a National Guard hat. He's like, yeah, it's my sponsor. I'm like, I know that. I'm just making small talk here, buddy. Do you just not get this? trying to break Does the he ice. not get the whole idea of small talk? So well, you, you want to rethink your answer now? <laughs> fire him! Fire No, give him another chance. <laughs> All, right. All right. For Buck Fever and Buzz Cutler, I'm Bass Masters. Goodbye. Rowdy.com, built by race fans for race fans. <laughs>